Hi guys, it's Cornish Kayak Angler. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I turn this standard specification Wilderness Systems Tarpon 120E into a fully rigged fishing kayak. Tarpon 120 is now rigged up, ready for fishing. Fully kitted out, ready to catch some fish. And we've now got a pair of flush mount rod holders fitted just behind the seat, perfect for holding the rods whilst paddling out to your fishing mark or whilst trolling a lure or two behind the kayak. We've also got the anchor trolley system fitted down the side of the kayak, fitted to the stern there, running all the way up to the bow. We've got a section of bungee at the bow to add some uh, shock absorption within that system and to keep the system nice and tight against the side of the kayak. And there's a zigzag cleat fitted just sort of beside the seat so it's nice and easy to access and lock off this anchor trolley line and the anchor system into the cleat. And the anchor trolley also forms a tow rope system as well which I've shown in a previous video. And that anchor trolley system is going to be used with a, a very simple anchoring system which comprises of a, of a dive reel there loaded up with 80 meters of 1.5 millimeter line and there's a folding grapnel anchor a 1.5 kilo folding grapnel anchor with a length of uh, six millimeter short link galvanized chain and that's set up as an anti-snag system with a cable tie weak link again showed in one of my anchoring videos how to set that up if you're interested and also fitted to the rails here i've got a rail blazer rod holder r and it's fitted using starport hd and the uh, hd track mount nuts there the track nuts so that allows you to easily loosen off and move the rod holder into the position you want the rod holder is fully adjustable as well they're really useful for for using while well, say trolling a law beside the kayak so that you can keep your rod tips in sight as you as you're trolling really handy there on the other side i've got fitted a railblazer rod tube with the same hd and track mount system there and that's useful for you know perhaps holding your rods whilst you're bait fishing uh, but various options there and they're easy to switch between them if needed or take them off completely if you don't need to use them at all and we've also got the Lawrence hook reveal 5 now fitted to this kayak so that's a G GPS chart plotter uh, also with chirp sonar down scan imaging it's also got software called Genesis live which allows you to build up your own charts uh, to, as, from your sonar readings as you're paddling along which is a uh, really neat but you can also add a chart card to it such as Navionics card uh, to get full bathymetry maps high definition sea, seabed maps and uh, that's fitted to the kite using a, a Railblazer Starport HD bolted to the deck there uh, and the Railblazer hook 2 mount which is designed for the fish finder all the wiring then passes into the hole for a scan strut cable seal nice waterproof fitting and this is where we find the power source the battery and the uh, transducer which I've installed inside the hull you can see that there using a sicker flex to glue that into the or against the hull battery is stored in a dry bag there to keep that nice and nice and dry but yeah that sonar will shoot through the hull using the in-hole installation method which I've, I've shown in a previous video exactly how to fit that how that can be set up using this fish finder so there we go the tarpon 120 now rigged up for fishing nice little setup perfect for coastal fishing um, it's really nice kite to paddle it's more than suitable for the waters we get here in the UK and uh, yeah some really nice features on it now so you can enjoy a day's fishing on the water. 
Okay, so that's a quick run through of how I've rigged up this Wilderness Systems Tarpon 120 into a fishing kayak, taking it from what was just a standard specification, sit on top for paddling, turned it into quite a capable fishing kayak. And this kayak is now suitable for maybe some bait fishing at anchor, uh, trolling lures, uh, and just general paddling and exploring as well. And it's more than capable for the coastal waters we get here in the UK. Uh, yeah, rigged up with an anchor, it's capable of anchoring, it's got a fish finder, so that'll help you locate the fish and show you what ground you're fishing over as well. And the GPS chart plot functionality on that is a really big help and it'll help you plot marks and uh, find, oh, well, go back to those fishing hotspots as well. So yeah, really great kayak. And if you're based here in the UK and you want to get a kayak just like this, make sure you check out Cornwall Canoes. They're a stockist of the Tarpon 120, as well as a whole host of other fishing kayaks. So I've popped a link in the description, make sure you check that out. Uh, so if you enjoyed that video guys, make sure you hit subscribe on my channel. There's going to be loads more videos of kayak overviews and rigging tutorials. So uh, yeah, make sure you subscribe for plenty more. And uh, if you really enjoyed the video, hit like. Okay, thanks for watching.